Okay, welcome to the base. I'm heading to uh, Placent uh, to my accommodation right now. So we stop by uh, our small uh, uh, okay, food stand here. So it's all fresh. So there's rice and there's rice here in Belize. I'm going to uh, plus uh, to, uh, to the western part, which is uh, San uh, San Ignacio, which is, uh, which is the area where the mine here is. All right, it's Arnel signing up from Belize. All right, I'm here okay, next in the food stand. Bye. Okay, I'm here in a store and I'm trying uh, the traditional rice and beans here, uh, here in uh, Belize. Okay, she's making me a rice and beans and then I'm skipping the meat. So it has, uh, what is it? So rice, of course rice and beans. Salad, right? Uh, I'm gonna get some salad, I'm gonna get some plantain. Uh, no chicken, no chicken, all right. <laughs> but I just like to try the rice and beans. So she's making me, so I don't, this is a bit of a Oh, there you go. So that's the, uh, that's my fontaine. Okay, so Belize is known as a fontaine. Right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to vegetables. All right, so now I'm signing out. I got my uh, traditional rice and beans here in, uh, in uh, Belize. I'm heading to uh, San Ignacio. Bye. You know that I'll find those words you say The warmth of marching band can play Those symphonies of better day And when my fooling heart won't break You know I'll find those words to say There was a girl beneath the moon My heart was hers far too soon and something about her when well, it didn't move i know she'll stay beneath the moon she was the girl i loved before my hungry heart will last no more i hope she always knew what i saw she was the girl that i loved before Hi everyone, this is Renel. So welcome to Belize. I finally made here in Belize, the last Central American country that I have to see. Now I can say that I've been to all Central American countries including Guatemala, El Salvador, Honduras, Nicaragua, Panama, and Costa Rica. So I am here in uh, San Ignacio, which is on the western part of the mainland Belize, which is close to the Guatemalan border. I am not, I'm, I'm skipping Guatemala and Tikal because I've been to Guatemala and Tikal about four years ago. I will be spending my five days here in uh, San Ignacio, uh, exploring the city, primarily exploring uh, the major Maya ruins, including Coracal, which I'm heading tomorrow, Sunantonich, and other minor Maya ruins that are within my reach in this uh, city. And uh, after my exploration of the Maya ruin here, I'll be heading to the coast. I will be going to the two major islands, including the Key Cocker, as well as the Ambergris Key. My plan is to go in and see the Blue Hole, and um, I hope to scuba dive. And in this uh, Caribbean warm water, and uh, Belize is known for, aside from the Mayan ruins, this country is also known for this, the second largest barrier reef in the world. 
course, the, the largest barrier reef is found in, in Australia. So Belize is known for the natural beauty and the preservation of nature. Apparently, I'm impressed on how Belizean can preserve the nature. Because on my way from the airport to San Ignacio, you can, you can see all green. And I'm pretty sure that, that there is a very, very low carbon footprints in this uh, nation. Okay, so I left the United States yesterday, uh, Wednesday? No, uh, today is what? Today is Friday. So my, no, I left Wednesday, United States at around uh, 7. Uh, I left home around 7 o'clock in the evening and I needed to catch the, the flight to the Houston, Texas at around 1. That was very early in the morning, so I never had to sleep yet at this time. Okay, which is bad needed because tomorrow is going to be a full day going to explore one of the major uh, ruin, the Caracol ruin. So back to my, uh, my story regarding my transit. So I came from, of course, San Francisco International Airport. And then I, I flew to Houston, Houston, Texas, where where my connection was, and then to Boulder City. It took about almost uh, nine to ten hours. There were no flight delays. It was very efficient. Uh, trans uh, trans uh, transport came okay, this time. So the only thing it was it, it, it was it was really really packed in both planes because. Um, a lot of tourists going to Belize. Belize, though it's a third world country, it's a tourist destination, and you can you can actually see uh, the involvement of both uh, public and uh, private sector and uh, the multicultural individuals in this country working together to preserve the nature because tourism as well as agriculture are the two main important industries in this country. All right, these are now signing out. Oh, by the way, I'm here in my hotel, so in, uh, in uh, San Ignacio. So I like the, the layout and the fixtures and the furnitures of this hotel here in, uh, in uh, San Ignacio, which is in the western part of the list. All right, see you later and hope everyone have a great day and happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Have a good day. Make it a great one. Bye for now. Bye from Belize. See you in the next video.